Sometimes life is about following lines. We drive by them, walk across them, even wait in them. And sometimes we walk fine lines, very fine lines. And everybody equates it to that. You could say that Tristan Wolf and his friends like to walk fine lines. They call it slacklining. What's slacklining, you ask? That's usually the second question we get when we're out. The, the simple explanation is tightrope walking. Although, be careful to avoid a comparison. No, we're not training for the circus. That's Thomas Trouter. A little shy on camera, maybe, but on the line, he can be, well, balanced. Easier to do than you probably realize. The principles behind slacklining are simple enough. Lock your core muscles, focus on a point ahead of you, don't fall down. Being able to manipulate your body by the focusing of muscles and movement um, is the center of slacklining. Very often, Tristan and his friends will attract some attention. We're always getting, you know, 10, 15 people stopping by to watch us and teaching new people all the time. It's Although sometimes not a very pleased crowd. Then we see the trees get messed up, I'll walk up and I'll just cut it off. So I, you guys can do what you want, as long as my trees don't get damaged. Once my trees get damaged, okay. then I'll be up. We've had issues on campus, you know, been booted out of a few places. With, uh, with cardboard, and we'll be sure to do that next time we set it up, okay? Sorry about that. No, it's okay. Yeah. Oh, you guys. Facilities management aside, slacklining is deeper than just walking a line. You know, there are meditative um, aspects of it. There are those days where you fall really hard, and, you know, you're definitely shaken from how scared you are from a beefy fall. Um, and then there are those times when you conquer that fear and you get back over it. And I mean, I was screaming when I f landed my first backflip. You know, I thought for sure I was going to go. <laughs> but, uh, you know, you definitely have those hype up points. So, yes, sometimes life is about walking fine lines, sometimes falling off, but always getting back on. At the University of Colorado, I'm Thomas Hendrick, your Palestra reporter.